One minute. One minute! If I can't drink this water, then my throat's not going to be lubricated. I'm not going to be able to talk. Yeah. Yeah, you'll give me a minute. Jesus Christ. Tom Daly, oh, just, he released on YouTube, he said he's, he's in a relationship with someone that he really cares about and that is awesome and that he's happy and that that someone is a man. <laughs> Tom Daly, who, if, in case you've forgotten who he is, I'm going to put his picture up here. So, whoop! That, that man that you just saw has had a penis in his mouth and he loved it! He sucked a dick and he liked it. Tom Daly is gay! We need to get serious now. At the Thanksgiving Macy's Day Parade 2013, just days before my filming this, I have no idea when you're watching this. You could be watching this in 2015. In which case, it would be two years and a few days before you're seeing this. But still, in relationship to when I'm making this, just a couple days before I made this, this happened, this parade, this event, this parade. Hey, did you watch the Macy's Day Parade? I can't hear you. But if you did, if you've ever watched the Macy's Day Parade, you know that they always have Broadway shows perform. Well, this year, the fabulously talented, flamboyant, and fantastic cast of the Tony Award winning musical Kinky Boots performed. Did they kill it? Um, of course they did. They knocked it out the park. Kinky Boots is a musical about some boy who own, whose father owned um, a shoe shop and it's not doing so hot and him and his drag queen friend decide to make to sell Kinky Boots um, to drag queens and business just takes off. That might be like a f kind of shitty um, plot synopsis because I've never seen the show, but from what I've read about it and I have listened to the soundtrack and I've danced to it um, pretty frequently and that's, that's what I get out of it. The point is, Facebook and Twitter lit up about it. Um, obviously a lot of people loved it, uh, myself included, and probably lots of other gays and Broadway fans. But that's not what I'm talking to you about, because this is the news, and the news doesn't talk about good things, because no one gives a shit about good news. Okay, so a bunch of people were, were blowing up on Facebook and Twitter, um, saying that the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade is a family event, and they should not have men in drag or sexually confused individuals dancing, because... The kids are watching. The kids are watching, and do the kids really need to see a grown man wearing high-heeled boots that go up past the knee and sparkle bedazzled red color? I, I just don't think so. I think that it will seriously disturb the children. I think they'll have nightmares. I think everything that they've, that they've learned up into their life until that point until that point, everything up until then has told them that life is this way. Once they see that, those men in the heels, oh God, the whole world comes crashing down. And as a child, it's, it has to be one of the worst things psychologically in the world because they're just, they're really effed. And there's, um, there's really no coming back. Wait, scratch that. Everything I just said is fucking false. I think it bothers the children far less than it bothers the adults of the Midwest. Let's just be honest. As a kid, if a kid sees a man in, a, in, in heels, it's probably just something that's a little bit it, funny because they don't typically see that. I don't think that's anything that's like earth-shatteringly like, 
like, ah, what is that? Get it off the TV. It's ruining my Thanksgiving. <laughs> but so, of course, the parents are ticked. This is a family event. It's not, there's a time and a place for drag queens, and that time and the place is not in Manhattan during a parade. Listen, if the drag queens cannot be present in Manhattan when there's a huge parade, when is it their time? This is the gays' time to shine. Gays love a parade, and gays love New York. This is prime time for the homosexuals. And so the parents are all like, well, how now the kids have questions because they've seen a man in a dress. Thank you, Macy's Day Thanksgiving Day Parade. Now there's a man in a dress in my kid's brain. They are asking me about it. What do I say? Maybe just tell them um, sometimes men like to dress up, wear a dress and heels and sing and dance. I'm telling you, for a kid, that's not that strange because they haven't pff, been brainwashed as much by society as you, the adult, have. I think it bothers you a lot more than it bothers the children. Anyways, um, look, and, and, then, and then like as an extension of this logic, should we not show pregnant women on, on TV? Because then the kids will say, Mom, where do babies come from? Why is she pregnant? Look, parents just need, stop being so afraid to talk to your children. The, the world out there has, has stuff going on that's not bad. It's not, maybe not fun to talk about, maybe it's a little awkward, but it's certainly not bad, and you shielding it like it is bad will make the kid think it is bad. Just, it's not the world's responsibility to protect and, and, and shield your children from things going on in the world. If it's going on in the world, God damn it, it's gonna be represented in the Macy's Day Parade. So just talk to your kids. It's not even a, it, 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 I guarantee your kid will not think it's a big deal. They'll probably give it a little chuckle and be on with their merry little way playing with their blocks and their toys. Whatever. One of the best parts of the whole story. The cast of Kinky Boots responded to this controversy by going, by going Black Friday shopping the day after the parade in Manhattan in full drag. That's right! That's right! Woo! All the men were wearing dresses, all the men were wearing boots. And they made a statement like, look, if there's no action, there's no progress, and someone has to start this dialogue. Talk about things for there to be progress, and if no one does anything, if no one takes action, then there's not gonna be any progress. So, you know what? <laughs> Hats off to you, cast of Kinky Boots. That was kick ass. That was kick ass. Good girls. I'm so proud of you girls. Um, just a reminder that Tom Daly is gay. I don't know if you missed the beginning of the video or if maybe it was on mute or something and you couldn't figure out the sound until it was already halfway in, but that's what you missed. If you missed the beginning of the video, you missed that Tom Daly is gay. He came out and he likes a man and um, he's probably been teabagged. Oh God. Paul Walker died. Who is he? Fast and the Furious? Uh. All right, so this has been an update um, consisting almost entirely of gay news. And I just want to remind everyone watching that is homosexual, that you were born gay but being fabulous is a choice. Tom Daly is gay. <laughs>